Now your Super Doppler 10 forecast with meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler. All right. Well, you know, I want to talk about the rainfall recently. Uh, September ended up pretty dry. We were 2.77 inches below the average. It's still early for October, but so far we're down uh, just about two tenths of an inch. But you add those up, and you know, it keeps adding this week. For the year, we're pretty wet, 3.62 inches above average. But in the short term, bottom line is we need some rain. And that's from the Norfolk Climate Site National Weather Service data, just for reference. Now, today, not expecting rain, big area high pressure around. And this is going to be around for the next couple of days. So we'll continue to have these northeast winds today and probably a little bit tomorrow. But then as we get later into the week, that's going to shut down. The high is going to drift east and we'll start to warm things up. So today and tomorrow, we're in the low to mid 70s. Then we're in the 80s, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So that's when we're going to warm things up. And uh, we're going to stay warm Sunday, probably in early next week. There's no real big cool downs coming back. So enjoy the coolness while you can because uh, even the overnight lows are going to start to increase soon. Now, current temps, we're at 50 in Newport News, 57 Norfolk, 51 Virginia Beach, 57 here in Portsmouth. You can see the number uh, close to me there. We got 45 in Chesapeake, 52 in Hampton, 47 in Suffolk, and 54 in Williamsburg, with mostly clear skies right now. Super Doppler 10, yeah, we got no rain out there this morning, not expecting rain for today. We got that big area high pressure, so we're going to have a lot of sunshine this morning. I do think we're going to see a little more cloud cover than the model shows this afternoon. Some other models suggest that a little moisture is going to try and come into the mid levels, so we might see a little more clouds, partly cloudy skies, and then overnight partly cloudy conditions until 7 a.m. tomorrow morning. Tomorrow, our model's uh, really beefing up the clouds at times. Matter of fact, it's trying to throw in some showers. I'm not buying any showers at this time. I'm going for a uh, little increase in clouds later in the day, but that's about it. But stay tuned for updates in case that tries to sneak in. So today, here it is. Mix of sun and clouds, 73 in Nags Head, 76 in Elizabeth City, 77 in Edenton, upper 70s in Ahoski. Also some upper 70s in Chesapeake and Franklin, but mid 70s in Suffolk, Portsmouth, 74 in Norfolk, 73 in Virginia Beach. You got a northeast wind at 5 to 10 miles an hour. 72 in Pocosin, 73 Hampton, low to mid 70s Newport News. You're in the upper 70s in Williamsburg, low 70s Yorktown, and 73 in Gloucester, 72 Irvington, and low 70s on the eastern shore. Fair skies, beautiful weather out there for today, and dry conditions. Dew points are in the 40s and 50s, so it's dry. Now, northeast winds on the water, 10 to 15 knots. You got seas three to four feet. The bay is one to two feet. And a quick check on the tropics. There's no tropical systems forecast at this time. We are watching this one small area here near the Bahamas, uh, just a cluster of storms that could try and develop a little bit and move west. So we'll watch that one. But right now, nothing for us, uh, nothing in the short term. So let's have a look at the seven day forecast. We got warming temperatures over the next few days. It's going to stay rain free. Uh, temperatures in the 80s by Thursday, 80 on Friday. Notice around Sunday we developed some scattered showers. Uh, past couple days it looked like the rain would stay just off to our west. Well, now it looks like it's going to scoot east a little bit. So I've got some scattered showers for Sunday and Monday with highs in the 80s, lows will be in the 60s. The humidity is going to start creeping up before that point, probably even by uh, Friday night or Saturday. But uh, Sunday could see some scattered showers in the region.